In today's video, we're going to check out some new functionality within TickTick, the command menu. The command menu gives you the ability to navigate to various parts within TickTick using only your keyboard. Hello, I'm Joshua Best. Alright, so to get started with the command menu, we're going to use a keyboard shortcut. And that is to hold down the control key while pressing the letter K. And that brings up the command menu. So right off the bat, we can see that new task is highlighted here. And so if we just hit enter right here, it's going to bring up new task. And so then we can fill out the details of the new task. Uh, in this case, I'm going to go ahead and hit escape and exit out of that. I'm going to bring up the command menu again, hitting control K. So what are our other options here? So we can navigate to task, navigate to calendar, it shows us. We can navigate to habits, search. So if we go to settings, it kind of gives us a clue that we could just type G then S and that'll take us right to settings. So let me type up here in the command menu, G S, and then I'm gonna hit enter. It takes me right to the settings. So that's pretty cool. Uh, I'm gonna hit done here bring it up again if we just start typing something so like if I just type in settings that'll come up and I can hit enter uh, bring up the command menu again so one of the things I realized while I was looking at this checking it out is this is really only used to navigate to different areas of the application right so I can go to today I can go to my inbox. If I keep scrolling down, I can go to trash, to the summary. So I'm not sure how useful I will find the command menu to be. To me, if I want to go to settings, it might just be easier to go up to my profile picture and uh, click on settings. That seems pretty easy to me. I don't envision myself uh, trying to bring up the command menu and then typing in G, then S. Although I can see that, you know, if you're a person that likes to use your keyboard, doesn't like your uh, fingers to leave the keyboard, you might find this useful. You know, this allows you to navigate to anywhere within TickTick -tick without uh, reaching for the mouse. And so that might save you some time if you're that type of uh, computer user. I myself am not. Uh, I tend to use the mouse. And so I think for the most part, I'll stick to just uh, pointing and clicking to get to uh, the different areas of the application. Uh, but this is a nice alternative. It is new functionality that just came out within the last couple weeks. Um, there is, however, one one thing that I might find it useful for. And you see my left panel over here on the on the left side. Obviously, um, I have today up at the top. Next seven days inbox completed trash. I don't know if you can see that behind my picture. Uh, but in, in any case, this is configurable, right? So. If I don't want to see today, I can hide today. If I don't want to see next seven days, I can hide next seven days. And actually, right now I have a section called tomorrow that's hidden. And if I wanted to see tomorrow without using the command menu, I would have to come in here to settings. I would have to go to smart list, find tomorrow on this list. You can see right now it's hidden. I'd have to flip this to show and then and then click done and then it would show up here I can look at it and then if I don't always want to see it I'd have to go through that same process again and and hide it but this is a case where using the command menu might come in handy if I just want to take a quick glance at tomorrow and I don't always want to to see it I can hit uh, control K to bring up the command menu and I can type in uh, go to tomorrow and it brings me right to the tomorrow view so I don't have to go change my settings or anything like that it brings it right up and then when I'm done with it I click off to whatever else today inbox doesn't matter so that is one useful case uh, for using the command menu all right so that about wraps it for me today uh, let me know what you guys think of the command menu functionality that tick tick just came out with uh, will you guys find it useful uh, or will you stick to uh, pointing and clicking like I uh, think I will let me know in the comments below all right thanks for watching have a good one